Yo, welcome to the Adobe <laughs> the anime. <laughs> And I say that those of you are shown to get their booty tickled by the government because the shit that they've been pulling on people like myself, I got caught. I got got. You know what I'm saying? I got got. You know what I'm saying? I, I was like, I was like, man's that went to fucking Japan or wherever the fucking got caught lacking by whatever coochie he clapped with no condom because now that man got the you know he got the surprise out of the mystery box and my surprise out of that mystery box was a fat ass cancellation fee of hundred and twenty six dollars. Yes, I yes, I know, that. crazy. I painful to die. very painful they've been doing this for a good minute and i never even knew this there really wasn't any videos popping up about the fact that adobe was doing this shit and i now know this because all of this just recently started happening since i made that video that i recently dropped a couple days ago i made that video a week ago which is when i found out of that cancellation fee the reason why i even wanted to cancel in the first place was because of the fact that they're basically saying that they will be able to go through your files and you can't do shit about it which um one you're not about to violate my privacy like that as if i just consent to it willingly and two i'm not finna trust where the fuck is doing that because uh the chances of somebody doing that and it's for you know even with tank uh yeah i'm not i'm not willing to stick around for it i just want to clarify on this part that it's only for photoshop and some other stuff attached to it i can't remember specifically it's basically it's basically for those but i'm still gonna say that i'm not gonna trust that shit like i still don't want to stick around and find out what else they gonna do because adobe already been doing bullshit and I, it just ain't worth to stick around to find out you know sometimes it ain't worth to fuck around and find out on certain stuff when it comes to this like i don't like i think they said something about the fact that if you do cancel the files that you have on adobe like your videos or uh photoshop photos and shit like that all of that gets basically took from you which is like okay well that's crazy <laughs> i mean don't get me wrong you really you really gonna rob me for my files like that then that's crazy i mean hey i just i just never y'all you i just never use y'all shit ever again at that point yeah i mean, i don't know how true that is i mean adobe is adobe you know if it's if it's true then that's fucked up it's bad enough that i'm stuck in a situation where i have to pay these motherfuckers regardless of what i do because they basically trapped me into a fucking cancellation fee that I can't even afford right now, which is one. And two, even if I could afford, I almost don't even want to pay for it because then I'm just throwing away money for no reason. Giving them, giving Adobe free money. And this is basically their way of saying, oh, uh, we really don't care about our customers, but we do care about our customers. This shit is so messed the fuck up. Fucking stupid. And like, and it's because... Like, I, I don't even know if I brought it up yet, but it's because they don't say any of this when you're going to buy Adobe. Like, when you're looking at Adobe, thinking about buying it for the first time and shit like that, none of this shows up at all when you're looking through. Like, and apparently you have to click through a bunch of, you have to click through a bunch of bullshit to even find the, you know, cancellation fee shit, which is crazy because it's like, bro, why do you have to click all that when it should have been right there in your face? See what I'm saying? And Adobe recently started updating their shit so they could try to escape the allegations, I guess. Which is the mind games that they're trying to do. Because they're trying to do this so that people who try to go back and to get more shit to point the fact out. And there's always going to be people out there that for some reason will go that hard as fuck for Adobe for whatever reason. Like, bro, I'll, what the fuck Adobe do for you? Like, did they rescue you from a Japanese slave house? If Adobe is doing shit like that for you to be die hard to defend them in what they're doing, brush shit under the rug so they don't have to, you know, deal with the government fucking them over, then you must be sick, my guy. Like, you really, really gonna defend motherfuckers who basically actively trapped people like me into having to pay a cancellation fee if they don't want to use Adobe anymore. You know what I'm saying? And I've been using Adobe for a good minute. I actually, I'm actually one of the people that didn't even have like issues with Adobe when I started using it, like Premiere Pro and shit. So I don't know if like the crashing issues is only for like Photoshop and stuff. Yeah, uh, Adobe has been fucking motherfuckers over it. And a lot of us are not dealing with it. In fact, they actually had employees turn on them too because, um, they don't rock with that bullshit you know what i'm saying they don't rock with that they don't rock with that at all in the slightest also 
I know somebody's probably gonna bring it up and be like, why not just call them? Like, only one, won't you just be able to do that and you won't have to deal with the cancellation fee? That's a whole roadblock that adds on to the complications on canceling the fucking subscription. Because apparently, one of three things will happen, and the third one is like something that will only happen if you come across that one employee that really don't want to deal with the shit and just will rather cap all the way through you know what i'm saying one thing that's going to happen is that they're just going to hang up on you another thing that's going to happen they just put you on hold and flick you through different support people and shit like that until you eventually give up the last thing that i heard happen on youtube and i don't know how common it is like i said it depends if you just get that one that just ain't want to deal with the shit they might just cap to you about canceling it and then you know you see your car getting charged still despite the fact that they said oh we cancel your subscription for you blah, 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 blah. you know what i'm saying and uh yeah you know motherfuckers aren't down for that but yeah they'll be soon to get their you know bang bros applications put in for the new jobs they're gonna be you know applying for you know what i'm saying they've been trying to look for some new hires for a good old minute for some spicy scenes i guess and everyone is waiting for their downfall me included like i swear to god man i i can't wait to see adobe get Kobu to the ground like they fighting Goku and Vegeta at the same time and I don't know how long it's gonna take sadly I, I think I already mentioned this before sadly I still have to pay the fucking money so I ain't gotta deal with they asses no more cause I'm not finna stick around to find out what happens next so it's not about to be an off the next time I'm on Dragon Ball Z and shit like I'm not letting that happen at all I'm just gonna stick to what I've been using before Adobe and that's that I'm not about to be a part of that so when I get my when I get the bread I'm just gonna throw it in the garbage for it you know I'm, I'm throwing it in the garbage but yeah that's that's basically it and I'll catch y'all in the next actual video